Hey up. So, I thought I'd do a little update video, just to keep you all in the loop as to what's going on. Uh, after the I'd done all the shameless uh, reviews up to what they've released at the time, uh, I've had a little break, and I've got a few things sorted, a few things are in the process of being sorted, as for the next series or the next sorts of videos that I'm going to be putting out. And I thought I'd share with you what the plans are. Uh, firstly, um, we got an announcement very recently, I'm talking like a few days ago from me recording this, that there is a new Shameless film being released. Um, so obviously I've got a pre-order ready for that and that will arrive as it is released and I'll make a video as soon as humanly possible after that gets delivered. Uh, so expect that early next year, I want to say sort of January time, that sort of thing. Uh, I'll definitely be carrying on the Shameless series, that's not going anywhere. As I've said previously, it's just a case of waiting for new releases to come out. Secondly, I would like to announce the next uh, review series that I will definitely be doing. I already own all the films for this series. Uh, I'm going to be taking a look at the AGFA, the American Genre Film uh, Archives, and 101's collaborative effort. Uh, I think they've been going for a few years now, and they've put out, at the time of recording this, about 18 films. I managed to grab them all. The uh, 101 sale really helped with that over October. Um, I thought they'd be a good one to look at as a lot of low budget stuff, a lot of weirdness, a lot of interesting oddities, and a few films that I've been dying to check out. Uh, so expect that series, because as I say, I've got all of the Blu-rays ready. Expect that series uh, very, very early, next month, maybe even next week. But don't hold me to that. Uh, hello, <laughs> Grace, I'm trying to record. Uh... <laughs> So part three, the thing that I want to talk about, is um, concurrently with the AGFA reviews, I do plan on having another film review series on the go. Now this isn't going to start for a little while because it has been an absolute pain in the arse to figure out. That being the Hardcore DVDs. You may remember these because they used to be sold in Poundland back in the early 2000s, like, well, late. 2007 to 2009, that sort of time, maybe even 2010. Uh, there used to be a pound in Poundland, they are much more than that these days, unfortunately, and there isn't really a comprehensive list online of all the films in the collection. So it's been a lot of sleuthing, a lot of figuring it out. I own roughly 20 of the films so far, but I think there are about 40, so I might be about halfway done with purchasing and finding these films. Um, it's loose at the moment, I'm still trying to figure out what there is in the collection. I have a little bit catalogued, uh, but any information regarding Hardcore, because there is minimal online, any information you guys might have, please let me know, put it in the comments. Always interesting to read about it and always interested to learn about it because, as I say, it's still quite a loose plan. It will be, take, it will be coming out I want to assume early-ish next year, first or second quarter next year, but don't hold me to that because this might be a little bit harder to sort than I initially thought, um, but those re when those reviews start they'll be running around the same time as the AGFA films as well. There might be a week where I do one, a week where I do the other, there might be a week off in between. I'm not going to be as strict, but they will always be released on Thursday these reviews, please bear that one in mind. Uh, but there may be weeks where I don't put anything out um, because I'm working on something else or something's something's getting in the way. I also make short films and animations on my other channel. Sometimes that sort of takes priority and the reviews sort of have to just have a few weeks off. But I'll try and be as consistent as I possibly can, uh, especially with two review series on the go. Lastly, uh, I've had requests from patrons and in the comments of the videos, I do try and read all the comments and I try and take on board any suggestions, um, any uh, recommendations that you guys put in there. Uh, I pay attention to all that sort of stuff and there have been a few ideas floated around that I do really want to give a go to. Now these will be, to start off with, these will be one-off videos. Um, but 
if the reception's good and if people like it. If you watch these videos and you like what you see, let me know, or you don't, let me know. Because if it's something that you want to see more of, then I'll happily make more of it. Um, but if it's something that you're not fussed about and you're like, you know what, this doesn't work, stick with your what we like, what we, what we know of, what you do, I'm happy with that as well. But I'm wanting to experiment a little bit more with the sort of things that are on this channel, but don't worry, it'll be the same types of films. It'll be the weird and obscure, the ridiculous and the horror theme. Um, that won't be going anywhere anytime soon. I'm still me, I still have my tastes. So, um, so there'll be a few of these popping up. I'm hoping there'll be at least one by the end of the year. Um, with a few more going into early next year. Uh, so, quite a few things uh, coming out in the future. Obviously, the continuation of Shameless. Uh, the Agfa 101 Blu-rays are going to be my priority. And that's going to be quite time consuming because some of those releases have got multiple films within them. And I will be taking a, a deep look into everything that's included in the release, as I'd like to do. So there might be, again, they might be a bit more staggered. Uh, like the Shameless ones where there might be a little bit of time in between each one. Uh, but they will be released on Thursdays. Then going into next year, the Hardcore uh, releases, I'll be starting to take a look at them when I have a comprehensive collection of everything that I believe released uh, by Hardcore. There is one request that I'd like to make though. So far, I think I have located and seen evidence of everything that Hardcore have put out, th that being except for one. Uh, the only evidence I have for this is on one of the Poundland leaflets that used to be included in some of the DVDs. Uh, Night of the Living Dead, the original George Romero one, apparently they put out a version, hardcore, you know, with the banner and the screaming head. I have looked, I have searched, and I have not even seen an image of it outside of this leaflet. There is nothing online. I've scoured eBay, I've scoured Amazon, I've scoured every website I can possibly think of, Google image searches all that sort of stuff and I'm coming up completely empty. The The company that owned Hardcore was Screen Entertainment and I don't know if they released it under that name instead, uh, but again I haven't found any evidence of that. If anybody knows anything, please let me know, please let me know because any information at this point is valuable because that is the main one that's putting a hole on this whole thing. I, I need to, if it exists, I need to find it, and I need to get it, and I need to review it. Um, and then also, that was a little aside, I do apologise, there is also the uh, the other types of videos that I'm going to be trying, um, they'll be coming up soon. Again, uh, if you love it, if you hate it, if you're indifferent, let me know. Always good to have feedback on that sort of thing. So, get ready for AGFA and 101 films coming very very soon and thanks for watching this hope you like the new stuff that comes out just let her explore you know this is my cat grace by the way for those of you who've not met her you've seen beck in a few other videos but uh grace used to be a downstairs cat but she started to venture upstairs a little bit what are you doing what is so interesting about this eh? if you bat that i'm gonna bat you grace you do know that well grace you're famous you've made it you've made it ain't you 